Jessica's 1991 here. Today I'm going to be filming a quick uh, three month update um, for me and for Ezekiel. Um, so he's with us today. Um, I want to start off with um, things that I've been loving um, so far um, this month. Um, the first thing that I've been loving is this scrub for my face. Um, it just minimizes my pores. Um, not that I have big pores, but it does keep my face nice and fresh. Um, this is the St. Ives uh, Blemish Control, the Apricot Scrub. And it has little, um, what is it called? The exfoliating little beads inside. Um, so it helps me feel nice and smooth for my face. Um, mainly because it's been really hot um, in my area. So I get really sweaty, and um, which clouds up the pores. <laughs> So I've been using that to clean out my face in the shower. Um, the other thing that I've been loving is my Estee Lauder um, High Gloss Lip Gloss. Um, I've just been having this on my diaper bag that I use also for my purse. I just throw this in here and it's just a quick, easy, um, you know, lip product for me. Um, that way I'm not, you know, having to use a mirror or anything. I just dash it on because obviously I have to be fast because I have baby. Um, the other thing that I've been loving is just this travel size little um, hairspray. First, I, I really want to buy the big bottle of it, but this is just for a trial. This came in my Ipsy bag um, that I get every month. Um, yeah, but I've been loving this. This actually holds really strong on the hair, and one of those days when I just, you know, get out of the shower, just put my hair up in a little bun, just spray some of this, and ready to go. So it's just a quick, easy... Um, hair style if you want to call it that I do um, another thing that I've been loving is this elf uh, makeup setting spray um, I know I talked this up I talked about this in my other videos but I really do love this especially for those hot days I just spray that on my face and it's just a quick refreshing um, on my face and it has all of it has um, aloe, it has green tea, cucumber, vitamin A, C, and E. So that's what it says on the front. And I'm already almost out of it. I need to get another one. I think it's like $3 at Target. So very inexpensive. Um, another thing that I've been loving is a sweet tea, sweet tea, sweet pea um, lotion from um, Bath and Body Works. I have the mini size, which I put in my diaper bag. And I have the big one, which I just keep in my room and just moisturize myself when I get out of the shower. So I've been loving that to keep myself from feeling all dry and icky from being hot outside. Um, another thing that I've been loving is my two-year planner. Um, I don't know why I said that, but my planner that I keep in my diaper bag, I just... Um, you know quickly put appointments anything that I have to do um, last week I had my finals for school so it was really hard for me to make video for you guys um, hopefully you guys understand that but when finals hit um, I'm busy you know studying trying to do everything you know trying to pass my classes so yeah that's what I've been you know a wall for a little bit um, but yeah but I've been writing my appointments in here like Ezekiel he just had his shots on the 18th of August so he is three months and five days today um, which is why I'm doing this now I kind of like to wait a little bit after he turns three just to get a quick you know real update of what he's doing now um, but yeah and then my husband's birthday was on the 21st of August and he has his own YouTube channel on here too um, if you guys want to go check him out, he is Major League Shooter on YouTube, and he started his own business as well. Uh, if you guys want to go check that out too, um, I'll leave a link down below so you guys can check that out if you guys want more info. Um, but another thing that I've been loving is this Wet Ones. Um, just for quick, you know, cleanups in the restaurants or, you know, in the store, when I put Ezekiel's cart inside the, um, his car put his car seat in the cart at the store I just like to wipe down everything you know even for my toddler my son that he rolled in the front I like to quickly um, clean all that mess um, so yeah that's it for me for this month um, now I'm gonna start with Ezekiel's favorites and he's been quiet 
but he is here. Um, the thing that he's been, that I've been loving for him are these, um, little, what are they called? Cloths, little white cloths, um, just to get his little spit up that he does. Um, he is drooling now more and I feel like he's going to be teething pretty soon. Um, because he does have little white, um little spots coming in so I'm guessing that those are his tooth coming in um, but he does have several in his mouth already so yeah I don't want that stage to come because it does get crazy <laughs> but he's been loving these little toy things um, he's been trying to reach and grab them I have the elephant one I have a little monkey one and a little giraffe one so I've been um, leaving several in his crib and then some of them I keep them in my bag just for a quick little you know um, when he gets fussy in the store I just play with him and he calms down another thing that I've been loving is this little teether thing it's from bright stars um, he doesn't really know how to hold this one because I think it's shaped weird I know they have some that are like circle ones which I need to get him because they're easier to grab but he does try to grab it but again his fingers miss some and then he ends up dropping it so I mean he's been liking it to put in his mouth to chew on it so another thing that he's been loving are these ring things that he just grabs onto and just puts it in his mouth um I do need to get more of these but for some reason they've been hard to find in the stores I don't know um, another thing that I've been loving for him are these bottles, the event bottles. Um, these are the natural bottles. Um, I know I have a video reviewing them on, if you guys want to go check that out. Um, but he has been loving this bottle. And again, they're easy for me to clean because they don't have that ring that I've been using. The classic Avon bottles that, that have a little ring to, um, you know, minimize the colic on the baby. But these don't have it it's built in in the nipple. So I've been loving these. Um, he is now formula fed. Um, I just feel like it was easier for me. Uh, mainly because I have school. I'm going back to work. And we just have a busy schedule. My husband's going to stay home with the baby. And it's just easier for him just to, you know, feed him. So, yeah. Um, another thing that I've been loving, and he outgrew them already, are these thirsty... Um, cloth diapers um, these go from zero to nine months it says these are size one thirsties um, and it goes from six to eighteen pounds and he's already eighteen to almost nineteen pounds um, so yeah he outgrew these they don't fit him they don't give him a good fit so I don't want any messes so he outgrew these and I am selling these um, if you guys want to check that out on my Poshmark account um, I don't know if you guys are interested, but yeah, I have nine of these. So he outgrew those. And then another thing that I've been loving for him is the Nose Frida. I know you guys heard this, um, heard about this before, but I actually wanted to give it a try because when he was a little bit younger, he would get, and he still gets, um, a little congested in his nose. And with the normal one that the doctor gives you at the hospital, those are like horrible those don't really work so i've been trying to get you know his suckers out it wouldn't work and i'm like okay i gotta find something that actually works so i looked it up and yep the nose frida got the number one rating and at first to me it looked kind of gross but just knowing that the filter is there and that the boogers don't go through the tube um you know made me feel a little bit better um but all you do is just you know suck on this part and then put the, um, the little tube to his nose and just suck like you're doing a straw and then boom, they're out. But before you do that, you want to put a little saline drops. So I have this little Remedies saline um, drops that I put in first and then I put the Nose Frida. And it's been working really well for us. Um, but it says all ages on here so it doesn't have anything because it is natural. Um, doesn't have any side effects or anything doesn't have alcohol in it um, another thing that I've been loving for his bottles as far as cleaning them I've been using the honest dish soap which works really well the only thing for me with this one is that it does run out faster I feel like it's a little bit more watery so I feel like I use it like I can just you know use it more without realizing that I have a lot of soap on here 
Um, so yeah, I, I used that one up and then I have the Dabble um, natural clean bottle to clean the bottles as well. And I have almost used that one up. But I like this one because it has the pump so I know how much to measure on the little sponge when I'm cleaning the bottles. And this one doesn't have the pump so it's just easier it's just easier for you to use more I feel like with this one um, but again you can just buy that and then refill if you want to use the honest company which I have done so yeah that's that another thing that I've been loving for him is this Aveeno baby um, calming comfort lavender and vanilla scent uh, lotion this has a um, what does it have? I don't know if it has oatmeal in it. I don't think it has oatmeal. Yeah, it does have oatmeal. Um, I don't know. It has like a little... It has like a nice soothing smell to it. And it does... Because um, I know it's similar to the Baby Johnson um, one that has the lavender scent. But I feel like this one was a little bit better uh, for him. Um, the cubes of moisturize. But yeah, that's it for um, what we've been liking this month. Um, again, he is three months now. He has been, um, you know, trying to reach things more, playing with his toys. He does like his uh, jungle gym that my daughter calls it. Um, it has like a little toys, music. He plays with it. I'll leave a little um, video for you guys so you guys can watch it real quick um, while I'm talking about it. But yeah, he's been loving that. Um, He's been loving his little piano where he lays down and he kicks on it so he plays music with his feet. Um, and he's also been able to identify mommy and daddy in the room. So if we say, you know, where's mommy? He's looking for mommy. And he does um, recognize us. So if I'm walking away from him, he turns his head and looks for me. So I think that's really cute. Um, again, he did get his shots on the 18th. So it was kind of late, which is weird because I know like at a regular pediatrician, he didn't go to a pediatrician um, office. I took him to a family medicine office and they said to bring him back at three months. But when I took him to a pediatrician office, because I felt like it was better um, for him, they told me he was supposed to come back at two months. So he is a little month after like late on his shots, which is fine. His next shots are at five months rather than at four months. Um, but it's fine he'll catch up when he's six months because they don't get shots until i think they're a year or something like that i'm not sure i forgot i know it's been a long time <laughs> my toddler is almost four now so it's been a while since i've done the whole baby thing um but yeah so he is in the 95 percentile on weight and on height i know um he's a chubby boy so he weighs 18 to almost 19 pounds which is big i guess um I don't know I kind of like it because I like chubby babies so I like that he's chubby but yeah he is a little bit chunky <laughs> for his age but again I like it um what else what else Bubba? um he is wearing nine months to 12 months clothes um I know that might be seen like big I he just wears six months clothes um but if it's a little bit tight for him but mainly I go bigger because of the cloth diapers um, so he is wearing one now. So as you guys can see, this is the 12 months um, clothing, and it does fit on his bum really good. Um, he's wearing the Grovia um, all-in-two diaper at the moment, and I've been loving them. Um, I have different brands. If you guys want to watch my video on my cloth diaper stash, you guys can see which ones I have for him. Um, but yeah, that's it for now. Um, you guys... Um, I think the next update that I'll make is that his five months um, rather than his four months only because he's gonna get his shots then um, but until then um, you guys um, you know stay, work with me because I am busy um, but thank you for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe and if you guys have any questions please leave a comment down below and I'll love to talk and communicate with you guys um, but until then um, I'll see you guys later. Bye.